Alex, how does it feel to uh, finally become a bear? Um, I'm absolutely delighted. It's something that I've been working towards for quite a long time, so to have put pen to paper at such a great club is a real privilege for myself. And tell us a bit about your route into the professional game. Uh, I started with Staffordshire. I worked with the EPP there. And then following my studies at Denston College, I went to university at Cardiff Metropolitan and I was part of the MCCU scheme there. So I've had four years on the scheme there under Mark O'Leary and this is something that we all work towards. And yeah, it's been a heck of a journey to get here. And I'm just pleased to be given the opportunity. And how important has the MCCU programme been as part of your development? It's been a huge thing for me. Uh, the transition from the MCCU to the second team it's really assisted me with my cricket. I felt comfortable coming into the Bears dressing room and the level of performance which you're training at with the MCCU is not too dissimilar from the level of performance here. It's just we're obtaining a degree alongside it as well. And you're a Staffordshire lad, obviously the, the Warwickshire partnership with Staffordshire bearing fruit with, with three of you now uh, signed on the pro ranks. Yeah, it's nice to see a few familiar faces in the dressing room with obviously Banksy and Mel. Uh, Mel being part of my club from uh, my youth days. So it's obviously a privilege to have those boys in the dressing room, but it's good to see that there's a strong link developing there as well. And obviously made your, your journey into the professional ranks a bit easier with some professional, well, some familiar faces around when you uh, made your second 11 debut last year. Yeah, well, the boys have been welcoming right from the start. The dressing room's been fantastic. You know, the coaches were brilliant um, from the moment that I walked through the door and the boys were very supportive. But obviously to have Alex and Liam there as well, and Andy and me who I've met a couple of times prior to joining the Bears, you know, it just made it all that easier to settle in with the boys and made me more comfortable with my performances and uh, allowed me to go out there with a bit more confidence. And then what was it like making your debut at uh, Headingley towards the end of last season? Uh, highlight of my cricket career, that is. Um, it came as a bit of a surprise. I wasn't expecting to be involved with the side. I got a phone call from Ash saying that I'd be in the 12 to go with a good chance of playing. So absolutely delighted to have made it and against such a strong side as well. And then how's your programme looking now that you've signed your first professional contract, uh, so, now that you've come in? I'm currently in Mondays and Fridays and we are very, very busy as you can tell by my fatigued look at the moment, we've been put through our paces, so yeah, very full on at the moment but thoroughly enjoying it so far and I'm looking forward to putting in the hard yards.